Hello, Ons Cat here. We're playing Hogwarts Legacy and I'm showing the collection for enemies, which you can find in anime layers, bandit camps, and also in famous foods. I show you Ravello, Elsa Travers, considered to be particularly close with friends with Victor Rookwood. Alice Travers is all too good at her job as an Ashwinder. And she has been one of Rookwood's most devoted followers from the beginning and helped Rookwood gain critical footing within Hogsmeade. Death Shadow, these agents of death attack mercilessly but will fall quickly to the power of a particular wand. Stone, Black, the Clock, this camouflage beast will often blend in with the environment to avoid detection until their prey is close enough to attack. The value can help you find them when exploring their habitats. While recovering from their attack launch, they are vulnerable to force spells that will flip or force their bodies in various directions. When his mouth is wide open, Leviosa can be used on his fleshy tongue to hoist it up into the air. Great Spined Bug Box Same description as the previous one. Cotton grass cookbook. Same explanation. Ashwinder Duelist. Among the quicker of Rookwood's agents, these witches will surprise their opponents with back to back attacks. The powerful reductor curse cannot be blocked by shield charms, but interrupting that cause with an Severing Charm will spin them to the point of losing control and hitting one of their own gang. Ashwinder Scout, these unscrupulous witches, witches have not mastered shield charms, so they are vulnerable to all sort of attacks. And Ashwinder Assassin, some of the most evil witches is alive. These secretive members of Brookwood's organization have spent years turning the peaceful dead into an army of their own in fury. They can summon in fairy to do their biting at the moment's notice, often surprising the foos as the animate, animated corpses emerge, best to prevent them from calling forth the fairy at all, but if all fails, fire will defeat the undead. Interrupting their reductor curse with a banishing charm will cause them to lose control of their spell and hit one of their own gang. Ashwind the Ranger. These witches have mastered the full body bind curse in order to capture and terrorize the victims. Since they prefer to avoid the heart of the battle, pulling them close with Akio is an effective way to disrupt the plans, as stunning spells is often enough to knock them totally unconscious, but cleverness and skill are required to succeedly cast at them. As wind the soldier, these wizards are skilled at deflecting simple attacks, so the shield charms must be broken first in order to defeat them. As they warm up their expulsive curse, levitating them with lift Viosa will cause them to lose the control and hit one of their own. As wind the executioner, these wizards have mastered the ability to create localized lightning bolts to strike down on their opponents. Is arming them with experience as they prepare to cast a lightning spell will cause them to lose control of the spell with self-destructive effect. Slowing down the wizard with an arrest or a momentum while they are conjuring lightning will keep the lightning striking longer, providing an opportunity to launch enemies into that lightning with a shocking result. A poacher duelist among the quickest agents of rock. Would these witches will surprise their opponents with back to back to attack. The reductor curse cannot be blocked by shield charms, but interrupting that with the severing charm was spin them to the point of losing control and hitting one of their own gang. Poacher Tracker. Yeah, it's the same as the previous as the S Winders. Poacher. Animagus, 
Zo'n pootje is een Rookwatch organisation heeft begonnen een imagi who can transform into the same animal, a ravenous wolf. But in the animagus form, they must be weakened and forced back into the human form before they can be properly defeated. The transformation spell, however, can catch them off guard and revert them in an instant. Interrupting their reductive curse with a banishing charm will cause them to lose control of their spell cast and hit one of their own gang. Poacher Ranger. Since they prefer to avoid the heart of the battle, pulling them in close with Accio is an effective way to disrupt their plans. Poacher Stalker. As they warm their blasting course, freezing them with glaciers will have a devastating effect. And Poacher Action Cushioner. They they conjuring fire. A low list assassin. You can use a rest of momentum against them. You need to dodge their attacks. A low list commander. They are vulnerable being slammed with the sendo. And also Loyalistil, a corrupted, using corrupted magic, ancient magic, increases the strength of all nearby goblins. Loyalist warriors. You can use Expelliarmus to get anything they are holding in their hands, leaving them. Loyalist Rangers. Inferiors. You can use mostly fire attacks or Bombardo or Ofringo, Incendio. Mannequin. This can be easily destroyed with all kinds of spell. A rampant duck book. This thing will have been corrupted with some kind of magic. Gwendolyn Zell. Blackmailed into compliance. Gwendolyn Zell was a reluctant icewinder informant within the Ministry of Magic. After being found out and fired, Gwendolyn was forced to join Wook to protect and provide for her family. Tempest Thorn, clinical and crew, Tempest Thorn was trapping and carving a beast for profit long before she left. Hogwarts, one of the first to join Rockwood's criminal empire under her gaze, the poachers have risen from scrambles to a sturdy operation. Inona Morgan, after graduating from Hogwarts, she was turned out by her emotionally abusive family. Looking to her old friends from school, she found a new family and home in the poacher pack. Sylvana Selwyn, born to a life of privilege but not born early enough to inherit it. He was known for his expensive and extra extravagant lifestyle. It was said that he would do anything to destroy the good reputation of his distinguished family. He was the one who opened doors to influential people for Rookwood. Dustin Trinity, a proficient pickpocket, Dustin has always enjoyed the art of thieving. In fact, it was his light fingernails that led him to a friendliness existence at Rookwood. Friendless. Um, Catherine Haggerty, estranged from her from a brother, Padraig, a local shopkeeper. Catherine turned to a life of petty thieving and trickery tricks years ago. It wasn't until recently that she abandoned small scams for a chance, had a bigger fortune with the Icewinders. Virgit, 
is a goblin rebel who fights under Renrock's banner. He is notorious for his colors towards everyone except those he truly fears or admires. Elgraf the Dutchener, now known for his militant approach to goblin rights, Elgraf the Dutchener was once a peaceful member of the goblin rights movement. It is said that the taste of power he got being around Renrock convinced him to change his ways. Grotbeek, a young outspoken goblin, Grotbeek rose through the ranks quickly and was a trusted guard of Renrock's minds. Hogbert the Old, he joined Renrock's loyalists after running with the security dragon of Gringrods. I must wonder if he provoked the dragon while orders bemoaned the cruelty of keeping dragons chained up on the round bank. Bardolf the Mount's corpse, the reanimated corpse that once was Bardorf, borrowed to Upper Hawksfield's Clermont, Barford had gone missing after allegedly connecting with Rookwood's lot, breaking the heart of the Beaumont family. Lord of the Manor, an affairs who was rich in life, though now the only indication of wealth is his clothing. Depth Condor. This beast is an aberration as it is not native to the region. In a short time here, however, this Acromantula persists, possibly murdered a number of other Acromantulas in the area. Insatiable spider, a horrific giant arachnid living underneath Mary Portman's cottage in Irishshire. Quagmire Troll, an especially mean forest troll who seems to enjoy wandering boggy areas. Alexandra Troll, with a train to know as it escaped his troll's tempting fate. If not killed by those wishing to loot its horde of items, it is likely to be the victim of a passing steam engine. Riparian Troll. Misunderstanding a comment with third with a jester this troll rampage through a small hamlet east of, of Hogwarts. The Grim, tough to be an omen of death upon the villages of Niederweg. This black wolf was simply a wolf who has been enchanted with some kind of magic. A chat is then with a great white wolf and a kin. The white wolf, a ferocious beast with striking white fur. Acromantula A venomous courier They can shoot venom and you need to use the cobalt potion to stop the potion from hurting you All spiders are weak against fire type spells Venomous hatching, which can be also defeated with just a normal deck. Venomous ambusher. Venomous shooter. Venomous matriarch. A torn back courier. And torn back hustling, torn back ambusher, torn back shooter, torn back matriarch, a pensive guardian, a pensive sentry, a pensive sento. Defensive protector, an armored throne, a fighter throne, a fortified throne, a Stido's monster, a death throne, a 
forest troll, a mountain troll, a river troll, and a dark mongrel, and a death's dark mongrel. So the one that is part of the deaths uh, is you can find in one of the trials. Most of the others you can find as infamous foos or just as the random enemy you can see you walk around in various areas as you explore. So these are all of them, so most of them you'll be able to either see by progressing the main story or by exploring and defeating the famous foos and bandit camps. Thank you for watching, wish you well, see you in the next video.